Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So we have our June 2025 Patch Tuesday security updates rolling out for Windows 10, which were released late yesterday in my region on the 10th of June. And the Patch Tuesday updates are compulsory mandatory updates unless you decide to pause the update for a couple of days. And for this month, the update is KB5060533. Now, because the update um, is mandatory, just to check our build upgrade by heading to Winver about Windows. For Windows 10 22H2, the OS build is now sitting on 19045.5965 after the update has been installed. Now, the Patch Tuesday updates that roll out on the second Tuesday of every month contain security improvements. And for this month, Windows 10 version 22H2 has received 35 fixes for 35 vulnerabilities. 34 are important and one is critical. So that's a highest ranked vulnerability. And that critical vulnerability is Windows Net Logon Elevation of Privilege Vulnerability listed as CVE 20253070. So 35 vulnerabilities one of those critical, so an important update. Now, because we are nearing the end of support of Windows 10, according to Microsoft, in October of this year, we are seeing less and less front-facing features rolling out to Windows 10. Obviously, Microsoft's focus now is on Windows 11. And although this is the case, the security update includes quality improvements that were part of this update, KB5058481, which was the optional bug fix C release update that rolled out towards the end of May last month. And I've posted a whole video on that. I'll leave that link down below in the end screen, but just a quick recap for the purpose of this video. First of all, it brings back the seconds, the clock, in the clock view display in the calendar fly out. It includes calendar flyout improvements. So if you have calendar installed on Windows 10, I don't. But if you do, you're going to see some improvements to the actual calendar. It fixes an account sync bug in the EEA. And there's some important fixes for GDR and GDR plus issues. And GDR basically stands for graphics device interface and is responsible for displaying graphics and images on screens and printers. So that's quite an important fix for GDR and GDR plus issues. And there were some other fixes taking place under the hood. But go check the video out for more information. And something else, um, which I'll also leave a video linked, is the account manager has also been removed in an ongoing kind of phased approach. I'll leave the video for that um, also linked down below and in the end screen if you'd like some more information. So. Microsoft making one or two changes and tweaks and adjustments, but when it comes to big features, we're not seeing that in Windows 10 anymore, as mentioned. But And then over and above that, the update also makes quality improvements to the servicing stack, which is the component that installs Windows updates. And that's more or less what's new with our latest Patch Tuesday Security Update for Windows 10 KB5060533. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.